Over the past few years, we've applied our experience with AI in phones to a growing pixel portfolio of devices, like watches, tablets, foldables, and buds. And as Google AI gets better, those devices keep getting better too. For instance, this week, we're rolling out our biggest update ever to Pixel Buds Pro. We're improving our clear calling technology, which automatically reduces background noise and enhances the voices on any phone call you receive. Just listen to the before and after. Grabbing a coffee next to the office and I got a few more meetings to get through and a quick errand and I'm gonna be ready to come out and join everybody for dinner. So are you still thinking of trying that place on 63rd? I've heard really great things about it. When you're listening to music and need to have a quick chat with a coworker or tell the barista your coffee order, you can just start talking. Pixel Buds Pro will automatically pause your audio and turn on transparency mode. Now we're also reducing latency by up to 50%, which is great news for the gamers out there. In the Google Home app, you'll soon get a streamlined view of what happened recently with a quick and easy summary. If you're wondering about your packages, you'll be able to ask about your home in natural language and quickly find the clip you're looking for from your Nest doorbell video history. Today, we're gonna to show you the next evolution of Pixel wearables and phones. Here's James to show you the next generation of Pixel wearables. I'd like to introduce you to Google Pixel Watch 2. We're upgrading our low profile design for Pixel Watch 2 with more durable cover glass and 100% recycled aluminum housing that's lighter and more comfortable to wear when you're at play and at rest. Elegant metals are designed to impress. Our new sport design is more breathable. The new quad-core CPU gives you smooth, snappy performance. Even with the display in always-on mode, you'll get 24 hours of use on a single charge. And it charges faster, too, with a 12-hour charge in just 30 minutes. You're also getting the full Wear OS 4 experience with new apps like Gmail and Calendar. Improvements to YouTube Music, Maps, and Google Assistant. And if you get into a bind, you now have Pixel safety features like medical information and emergency sharing right on your watch. We're also bringing safety check over from our Pixel phones to make sure you don't feel alone on the trail or on your walk home. Pixel Watch's heart rate sensor has been upgraded from a single path sensor to a brand new, fully redesigned multi-path sensor. So now your heart rate can be measured in multiple locations on your wrist. The new skin temperature sensor delivers better insights into your sleep and overall wellness. And the new continuous electrodermal activity sensor, or CEDA sensor, powers Fitbit's body response. It detects moments when you're physically showing signs of stress, offers interventions to de-stress, and then afterwards prompts reflection over your day and week to help you better manage your stress in the future. We see so many possibilities to use AI to bring you personalized coaching, dynamic workout recommendations, and even more context and insight. With new sensors, longer battery life, new features like body response, updated watch faces and bands, and the updated Fitbit app, Pixel Watch 2 delivers a completely upgraded smartwatch experience. Pixel Watch 2 comes in a Wi-Fi and an LT version. You can pre-order starting today and they'll ship next week. I'm excited to introduce you to the next evolution of AI in your hand. Google Pixel 8 Pro and Google Pixel 8. They're the first phones to use our latest Google Tensor chip. They include the very best Android experience, first of their kind camera experiences, and the latest AI advancements from Google. Instead of angular corners and edges, Pixel devices replicates that calming feeling of picking up a smooth piece of sea glass. Pixel 8 Pro introduces new considered design elements into the portfolio. We're using a soft, 
silky matte glass finish to contrast with the high polished camera bar and highlight our powerful new camera system. And our new bay blue color is both energetic and hopeful. We're even updating Pixel Buds Pro today with new colors to go with our new phones, including bay blue and porcelain. And we're working to make Pixel phones easier to repair. We've partnered with iFixit to offer parts, tools, and repair guides directly to DIYers. So we've been working on a new display offering, which we're calling the Actra display. It's 42% brighter than on Pixel 7, and Pixel 8 Pro takes our real-world display technology to the next level with our new Super Actra display. The 6.7-inch display is even more immersive, and it's our brightest display yet, with a stunning peak brightness of 2400 nits and a variable refresh rate that intelligently adjusts from 1 to 120 hertz. On the back of Pixel 8 Pro, you can see that we've added a new temperature sensor. It's a convenient and a quick way to check the temp on a pan or to make sure that the milk in your baby's bottle is just the right temperature. In our new Tensor G3 chip, every major subsystem has been upgraded. It includes the latest generation of ARM CPUs, an upgraded GPU, new ISP and imaging DSP, and of course, the TPU, our on-device AI engine that we've custom designed to run Google's AI models efficiently. Compared to the first generation of Tensor on Pixel 6, the new Pixel 8 runs more than twice as many machine learning models on device. You can already use Pixel to type, edit, and send messages with your voice, now Pixel 8 even knows what language you're speaking and can switch back and forth with you as you talk in multiple languages. So I can just long press on the power button and Pixel 8 will read web pages out loud for me. Six must try tips for taking incredible pet photos with your Pixel. And Google speech models are also behind Pixel Call Assist and automatically removing background noise from your calls with clear calling and saving you from calls you don't want with call screen. It silently answers calls from unknown numbers with a new, more natural speaking voice, and it's smart enough to separate the calls you really want from the calls you really don't. Hi, I'm a Google virtual calling assistant recording this call on behalf of the person you're trying to reach. Can you say what you're calling about? Hi, you've won an all expense paid trip to the Caribbean. Press eight to claim your prize now. Unfortunately, the person you're calling cannot take your call right now. Have a nice day. But some calls about travel are actually important. Call screen will soon offer contextual replies so you can respond in a tap without even taking the call. We have so much exciting new camera magic to share with you today. The video capabilities in Pixel 8 represent years of R&D across Tensor, AI, and software. Combine that work with the upgraded main sensor and you'll see vast improvements in low light video performance, dynamic range, and shadow noise. And we're continuing to expand our image equity efforts with Realtone, so your videos and photos accurately portray the wide range of human skin tones. So we are pioneering new computational audio capabilities with the first of its kind feature called Audio Magic Eraser. Best Take uses a series of photos taken closer together to help you create the shot you want. So you can choose what you think is the best expression. For everyone in the photo. Of course, sometimes you might want to use your imagination to create something new. As we announced at I.O., Magic Editor in Google Photos lets you use generative AI to reimagine your photos. Just tap or circle the object you want to edit, drag to reposition your subject, pinch to resize them, or use one-tap presets to make the background pop. The triple rear pro camera system gets a new main sensor with better low light performance, a bigger ultra wide lens with even better macro focus, an upgraded telephoto that can capture 56% more light and take photos with 10x optical quality. And we've added 
autofocus on the front facing camera so you can take the best pixel selfies ever. We're also introducing new pro controls on Pixel 8 Pro for photographers who want total creative control over the camera. Introducing a new form of video processing called Video Boost. Look at how it compares to a different phone we picked up recently. You can see the skin tone is lifelike and properly balanced, while the mountains and skies have full dynamic range. Every frame of this 4K video has gone through our HDR Plus image pipeline. And when you use Video Boost in low light, it automatically enables night sight video for the first time on Pixel. Video Boost is coming to Pixel 8 Pro in a feature drop in December. Just a few months ago, we launched BARG as an early experiment. Today, I'm excited to share an early peek at something we've been working on. We call it Assistant with Bard. Make me a grocery list for the weekend for uh, 10 people. Go heavy on the snacks and we'll probably want a smoothie, so recommend and include ingredients for that. Now just imagine how much time it would take to make this on your own. And with a quick tap, you can move it into a dock and share with your friends so you can coordinate. It took less than a minute to create. From here, you can ask for recommendations on things to see, build a weekend itinerary, discover the best spots to soak in the views, and anything else you need to make planning and prep a breeze. This conversational overlay is a completely new way to interact with your phone and lets Assistant with Bard meet you wherever you are. We are rolling out Assistant with Bard to select testers shortly and we'll be expanding availability as an opt-in experience in the next few months. Google's AI research teams are changing everything in this space with generative AI foundation models. Proofread and Gboard now takes advantage of generative large language models in the cloud, so it can go way beyond fixing typos. Pixel's getting better at understanding the language and content, like web pages. We engineered Pixel 8 Pro to be the first phone to run Google's foundation models directly on the device. Pixel 8 Pro can run generative AI with up to 150 times more computations than the largest ML model on Pixel 7. Instead of blending the surrounding pixels, the improved Magic Eraser generates completely new pixels to fill in the spaces left behind by cars, people, or anything else you don't want in your shot. And we're working hard on lots more generative AI features that are coming to Pixel over the next few months. Recorders getting even more helpful with on-device summarizations. With on-device generative AI and Pixel 8 Pro, you'll be able to get concise summaries of your recordings that quickly recap the highlights from a recorded meeting or presentation. Our newest feature building on this will be Zoom Enhance. When you pinch in, Zoom Enhance can intelligently sharpen and enhance the details of your images so you can get closer than ever, even when you forget to zoom. We're so excited about the future of the Pixel portfolio. Thanks for letting us share our vision with you today. And Pixel 8 is available for pre-order today with some great offers. Pixel 8 Pro is available for pre-order now in a fresh range of colors, and it'll be on shelves with Pixel 8 next week. Google is expanding Pixel support to seven years. <laughs> seven years of OS upgrades, security updates, feature drops, and AI innovations. Well, that's our show for today. There's a lot more to these new products and services. You can get all the details right now on the Google Store. Thanks so much for joining us. We'll see you all again very soon.